Hi, this is Paul from TradeTheFifth.com, and this is my daily stock signals video for Wednesday, the 14th of November, where I choose just one of the signals from our Stock Signals membership, where we give potential long fifth wave trades and short fifth wave trades on the 60 minute, the daily, and the weekly time frames. So you can see here in the members here, and we can click on short or long waves. Uh, shorts I'm going to go for today again, uh, and our members just click on the image and download the spreadsheet for the day, which looks like something like this for today. I'm going to look on the daily time frame, potential shorts, lot setting up here. Uh, they're also 60 minute and weekly down at the bottom on the top zone. I'm going to look on this on the daily for now. I'm going to look at IP, International Paper Co. I'm going to set this trade up from our signal. And remember, it's a potential short fifth wave trade on the daily time frame. So this is our Elliott Wave Indicator Suite for the Think or Swim trading platforms, also available for TradeStation, NinjaTrader and Multicharts. I've just zoomed out a little bit here to show you this current bearish trend that we're in on IP on the daily time frame right from the beginning of this year, 2018. As you can see, our Elliott Wave Indicator Suite has labelled it the 1, 2, 3 and the Wave 4. And this is the Wave 4 that we're really interested in right now so we can look to trade that fifth wave. So let's zoom in here and have a closer look at this. So first of all, just a few filters, go through this again. I do it every day just to remind everybody, not just our users, but for new people. We have a few filters on there for our um, stocks uh, signals membership for that for those uh, signals there. So the first is that we've had a wave four pullback against the main trend. And this is uh, formed resistance in this case, because it's a potential short in the green zone here. This green zone is part of our Elliott Wave Indicator Suite. We have the green, amber, red. And uh, the green zone represents an 85% probably it's going to go on and make a new wave five low into our automated target zones all the way down here at $37. The next is the performance of that waveform. The first way to measure that is our 535 oscillator. And during this waveform, it's pulled back between 90 and 140% of that third wave, as you can see here, as it's pulled back into the green. The next is our stochastic. This is the middle of the subcharts. Uh, and this has got a false breakout dots right in the bottom here in the oversold zone. That denotes a really strong bearish trend. When the stochastic pulls back against there and crosses over in the overbought zone, it's likely and it wants to return to that main bearish trend. So we've got those three main basic filters. Another filter I've used is part of our um, day trading add-on suite, our multiple time frame dot card, but all I've done is adjusted uh, the, and the, the dots. So you can see here this bottom row of dots is our monthly time frame, and we are below what we see here. You can see our special W5T EMA cloud. We are actually below the cloud on the monthly, the weekly, the four day, the three day, and almost now on the two day, on the one day, sorry, on this. We see we're just in the cloud right here. And once this goes out of the cloud uh, and hopefully into our position here, you'll see all of those dots turn red and we get the red square, denoting a really strong possible potential bearish trend there. So let's have a look at the entry for this. Uh, we have the stop loss just above the wave four there, around about 47.58. The entry is outside of the 6.4 moving average low for today's bar position below the cloud here and also just below the lows of this uh, little consolidation zone here so 44.88 is the entry and our target is $37 so we've got a risk to reward of one to three there if this goes could be a really really good trade um, again sensible entry though we're outside the 6.4 moving average low which is part of our Elliott Wave Indicator Suite so we've, we've basically set this up from our signals We've had that pullback against the main trend. We've measured how that pullback has performed using our Elliott Wave Indicator Suite, and this is a great looking signal. So just to remind you, it's IP on the daily time frame for a short. The short entry is 44.88. The stop loss is 47.58, and my target is $37, which is part of our automated target zone there. So that's it for today. Have a great trading day. Speak to you all tomorrow.